Dave, what's, what's one thing that was maybe surprising or anything that was, after you toured the factory or the information that was given, is there anything that really stood out, even if it was covered here? Like, what was something that really stood out from your time today at Giga Texas? Yeah, hello. Hey, guys. Yeah, I wish everybody could have gone on the factory tour. It was probably the best factory tour I've seen. Um, I've been to Fremont a few times, and I saw the Austin, the Giga one last year. But this time around, the factory was just bustling. It was just making, pumping out cars. Um, every station, everyone knew what they're doing. It's just well laid out, like start to finish, um, compared to Fremont, which is very just kind of scattered a bit. And the thing that was the home run for me was the very end where they showed the dry electrode machine. So they said they have five of them right now. And they say they're on generation six. And the latest generation is in Austin. Generation five is in, uh, in Fremont right now. So Texas has generation six. They have five of them. And this thing they're saying is, is rolling out this electrode material like constantly. It's just with, and it's completely automated. It's like pretty much, there's some people maybe doing a little stuff, but it's, it's automated. And they have this roll and they have the roll in front where they showed all of us. And it was probably about six feet wide and probably like three feet or so in diameter. And it's this big electrode roll that they've rolled. You don't need any drying time. It's just, you know, they're whipping it out almost instantly. And then they cut this thing into like, I think 16 parts, was it? They cut it into 16 parts and that goes into the, the batteries straight. And it's, it's like, I think Tesla is actually like way ahead of what most people think they are in terms of battery technology. Um, they actually have this thing working. It's more about, I think, optimization and constant improvement. And they said that they're working on generation seven right now of the machine, and they hope to have that out later this year. So there's a lot that Tesla isn't publicly announcing with what they're doing, but they, it ends up in the product. And that's the reason why they're able to do what they're able to do. And so, yeah, the, the 4680, Electro, that's just mind-boggling. Wow, okay.